So welcome everybody to our 2023 Autumn Equinox session. So what I'd like you to do is get yourself in a position where your back is supported fully. So any kind of posture you would like to take where you feel comfortable where the back is fully supported either by the floor or some furniture. So what I'd like you to do is just settle into that position. So hopefully you're all in that now. And I'd really like you to sink your back into whatever is supporting it. So just feel the body here. So if you're lying down, just making any final adjustments so that you will be comfortable. If you're sitting down, just make sure the feet are supported. So you can get a cushion or a little stool or something just so the feet are supported. Your feet might touch the floor comfortably, but mine don't. So I always feel the urge to cross them. But I really want you to feel the footprints really grounded into the floor and your back supported. So sink the feet into the carpet or the floor. Allow the sitting bones to sink into the seat. Allow the seat to take the weight of your back. And as you close the eyes, just check in with yourself. So firstly, feeling that support of the floor or the furniture underneath your back. So checking in with the body, checking if there's any twinges in the spine, in the back, in the body at all. Checking in with the mind and the emotions any vague senses of stress or irritation or maybe they're more palpable than that and then let's just check in with how we feel in relation to this festival so the harvest season and the upcoming autumn does it feel like it's suddenly upon you like the year is slipping away or do you feel like it's been autumn forever with the weather we've been having just notice how you feel about this change. Notice if you can acknowledge mentally that change. Notice where your energy is at. Is it drifting behind you on the season that's been? Is it present here or is it looking ahead to the future? How do you feel about moving into a period that welcomes a sense of gathering and sorting and preparation. Where is your mind in relation to that? So, just noticing that, just noticing how we're feeling. And let's arrive here today into this session with the intention of allowing ourselves to flow into this new autumn season. So we're gonna do that in our comfortable positions with our eyes closed by taking the deepest breath we've taken all day through the nose and then sigh that out on an out breath through the mouth. You might not feel comfortable taking an audible sigh, but just make any noise that you feel comfortable to. Breathing in deeply through the nose, filling the lungs, feeling the belly, chest and collarbones rise. And then when they're full to your capacity, not waiting for me to tell you, sighing that out with an out breath. So take three of those, just arriving here. And on those deep sighs out, just feel the bones settling in to the chair or the floor. Feeling yourself sink in to this space. Feeling the body weight just being allowed to be held. Good. And then we might notice the breath coming back to the body in a more relaxed, calm state. But let's just help that along a little bit. So let's place one hand around the chest area, around the heart area, and one on the belly now. And start taking a longer than usual breath in to the hands. 
and allowing the breath out to be deeper and longer than usual as well. So nothing forced, not over breathing, just gently allowing the breath to ease into the hands in a slower, deeper way than usual. So pushing the breath into the front of the body, feeling the hands rise on the chest and the belly, but also feel it push into the back body too and feel the back push in to the floor or the chair and feel that sense of support as you do that of something having your back so we're expanding the lungs both front and back feeling that bodily contact at the front of the body with the hands and the back of the body with the floor or the chair feeling that contact with the back of the body as well as whatever you sit against or lie on. And just continue feeling the hands rise and fall and feeling the back expand into the surface behind you or underneath you. And noticing how the body responds to that. So just allow the breath to form its own pattern, but just notice if you can shape that into an equal breath, if your body needs that. So listening to yourself, does this feel good? Or if you consciously and deliberately allow the in-breaths and the out-breaths to be equal length, does that feel better for you? Now you're easing the body into the relaxation response. What is the breath naturally doing for you? Just go with the pattern and rhythm that works for you, that makes you feel good. Take a few more rounds of that. Just really sinking into this moment, just allowing the breath to be pushed equally into the front and back of the body and perhaps equal in and out breaths, equal lengths for the in and out breath. Just feeling that sense of balance that, in, that is introduced to the body as you do that. Take a few more of those. And then just drop the hands, drop any conscious breathing. And notice if the body simply continues in that pace and rhythm for you, or if it becomes slightly softer or a different response entirely. So maybe the out-breath length is different to the in-breath. Good. And now let's maintain that quality deep breath. And just feel in to the sense of the weight of the feet where they contact the floor. For some of this, it will be the whole soles of the feet and for some of us, it will be the back of the heels. And just notice if the weight feels equally balanced. 
don't change it if it's not that's fine just meet yourself where you are and then what about the points of connection between the back body and the floor or furniture do they feel equally weighted on either side and then let's feel into the undulations of the body along that surface. So if you're sitting in a chair, the arches of the feet and the balls of the feet and heels touching the floor. Maybe you feel the curve from the ankles to the calves and a tiny space behind the knees and then the solid weight of the sitting bones meeting the surface that supports your back or your seat. And then the arch of the lower back and the mid ribs meeting the surface that supports your back. And maybe you also have an awareness of the curve of your neck and where the back of the head meets a surface. And bring your attention to the whole back body now. So try and obtain an awareness of the whole of the back body from head to heels. And then if you're lying down, I'd like you to bring your attention below the back of the body, below the whole back of the body. And if you're sitting down, you will bring your attention to below the soles of the feet. And then below the comfortable surface, below that, so underneath the feet, underneath the back, whatever covers the floor, bringing your attention lower into the solid foundations of the building and further still into the earth below the building. And go as far as you would like to. Giving yourself permission to sink more deeply into relaxation by just allowing the attention to drift under the layers of what's physically here beneath us. Drifting lower and lower and lower into the earth that supports us below. Good. Notice the effects of that on the body. Notice if it makes any of your body parts tingle. Notice the effect on the mood and the mind. Now, can you give yourself permission to allow that same depth of connection with your inner self and sense of being? So can you just subtly shift that focus now so that you are bringing that same depth and searching awareness into the depths of you? allowing the breath to gently take you to a warm, welcoming space inside of you to your sense of inner being, gently drifting to that spot where you allow yourself to go deeper into you. And perhaps you feel like you yourself have sunk below the surface into the earth and just go with that. 
just go as deeply as you feel comfortable to today. So I'm giving you permission to do that. So go ahead and allow yourself to go deeply into your own being now in whatever way that means for you, in any way you experience that. And just rest there for a few moments, floating here. Good. And in this deeply relaxed state, just enjoying this sense of you, deeply connected and grounded, I'm going to offer the suggestion of some focus that you can give to yourself now. of where you might want to cast your attention effectively and to enhance your well-being in this state of relaxation. And from this place, I'd like you to get a sense of where your life just flows and grows. So no matter what is or isn't happening in our lives, there is always something that's going well. So just allow your inner being, your awareness, to just locate that for you and hold it in your observation now. Allowing it to be presented to you effortlessly. Not getting attached to what it might be, but just allowing that to come to you now. And can you explore that a little bit more and journey into the feelings of that a little bit? Feeling into that place that feels really balanced in your life. Do you feel a sense of joy, satisfaction, appreciation what feelings does this give you this sense of something feeling really balanced and well in your life and it could be anything at all just something that works that flows that's effortless that's easy Just explore that for a few moments now. Now, where is there imbalance in your life? where there may be too much or too little of something, where you might be putting too much or too little attention. Again, just allow this to be presented to you from this deeply relaxed state, not getting the mind involved, not engaging the emotional response too much, just allowing it to be made available to your awareness. And we won't spend too long here. We're just acknowledging that it's here. Good. And now let's once again cast our attention back to the space behind or below the body, the earth below, and feeling the neutrality of that. the inherent sense of balance and harmony 
and objectivity. And is there anything you don't need from that sense of imbalance that you don't need anymore? that you can just allow to drift into the space below or behind you, into the earth below. Can you siphon off some of that imbalance into this space here? Can you just allow that to filter out of you where the earth gladly receives this? requiring any and all energy for its growth and development, willingly takes it. Any sense of that imbalance, just leaving it behind, if that's right for you today. Maybe too much thought, obsessing on something or just simply given to something or maybe something that keeps repeating and happening in your life. Just letting it go. And then equally, can we allow that overall feeling of well-being from those qualities of being imbalanced to flood our systems now. So maybe we can enhance and exaggerate that from this sense of place, of neutrality, of balance from the earth below. Maybe we can encourage more of that into us as we just allow it to diffuse into our systems. And as you are doing this, I'd like you to just really conjure and explore and expand that sense of well-being from the feeling you got from something that's in balance in your life, that's flowing and growing easily and well. And maybe even pulling from this area any new feelings we can foster, anything new that we're ready for. It all starts with a feeling. So what new feelings are you ready to welcome into your life with the season ahead? Perhaps it's stability, well-being, trust, a sense of self, maybe physical things. maybe more discernment of where to spend your time or who to spend it with. And take what you need now. And notice how that feels. Notice if that expands and enhances those feelings of balance and well-being, can you allow those to grow in your awareness here for a few moments? And just go as deep as you can into that sense now, this newly fostered sense of expanded well-being, of hope, and contentment and joy for the future. Of all the wonderful things in your life that are just flowing and growing. And just stay there and again just allowing the impressions of the words offered to see if in this place whether you can get insight of what you might benefit from gaining a fresh perspective on. 
just allowing space for that not forcing it just allowing that awareness to come to you if that's right for you she might get that insight right now or tomorrow or next week next month or another time just be open to receiving it or not just enjoying this space for what it is now Good, and a few more moments here. leave that wherever it is today and let's just allow ourselves to gently gently drift up through the layers of our awareness now back to the sense of the body being supported by the chair or the floor and breathe in to those points of connection between your body and the floor or furniture now. Feeling once again the sensation of the feet balanced on the floor. Notice if they seem a little bit more equally weighted now. Do the sitting bones and hips feel more equally weighted? As you travel up, the curvature of the spine is the weight more towards the mid-back rather than the shoulders. Are the shoulders more relaxed? Is the head heavy? Feel the body breathing here. Feel the tone of the breath. Feel the rhythm and pace that it has shaped for you. Allow yourselves to just rebalance and feel that sense of rebalance from this practice. And then adjust again to bring that sense of balance in to the rest of your day. Good. And notice how you feel now and just allow yourselves to very gently when you're ready Make some very small movements and slowly bring your awareness back to right now, consciously. So making very small movements and if we're lying down when you are ready, you can roll over to one side and push yourself gently up to sitting and then only when you're ready opening the eyes. That is the end of today's session. I hope you enjoyed our autumn equinox practice for 2023. And I hope that you feel a lot more rebalanced and looking forward to the season ahead.